when I wait what? <laughs> Hi everybody. <laughs> We're doing another stash well not a. Uh, it's a taste the world series video and we have some awesome treats from Daniela who is Daniela Scheiss Mueller here on YouTube. And I'm gonna let Derek try to say what this one is. <laughs> Will this our rings? Is <laughs> that like Worcestershire like sauce? <laughs> no. Like Willis sour rings, but they're rings. They're cookies that are in a ring shape, and I'm not sure if you're getting that or if you're getting a glare here. Ooh. But she sent a couple things for us to try, so we're going to try those. They look really good, and she was saying that um, they're kind of like um, they're a traditional cookie for Switzerland and they're um, kind of a, a honey, a honey flavor. It smells like something from my childhood, but I do not remember. Graham cracker, kind, not a graham, like the animal crackers with a graham cracker, kind of. <laughs> <laughs> Crunchy, huh? Is it? They sound really Lemon. good. Lemon. Lemon. Yep. Mm. It's like, the, like a biscotti. Yeah. Like a lemon biscotti. But it's like peanut butter crunch. Mm. I don't think it's like. Oh, yeah, without the powdered sugar on it. <laughs> and crunch you. The Girl Scout cookies, Savannah Smiles. So, well, those are. Yeah, but these, like, you could see what they look like on the picture of the box. But they're like a powder cookie. But that's the same lemony flavor that they have. These are really, really good. Really crunchy. It'd probably be good to dunk. I'd say dunk and uh, it's a bit more of a tea though than with coffee. It's good with coffee, but I can see it being better with tea. How's it with silk? Good. Well, let's go with soap. It'd with probably coffee. really, really be good with tea, what you're saying, mm -hmm. and coffee. And they don't fall apart like ours. Yeah. Are you going to try to like save some for soaking you? Soaking it? Oh, do I get to eat them all? <laughs> I'm a good sister. <laughs> mm -hmm. oh, am I going to have to try to pronounce this? Mm -hmm. Oh, I get the complicated ones. Pseudo Zoe Chagall set 1840. I can say that. <laughs> and they're really pretty. I feel. No, I'm not gonna say You're it. You're gonna show what the cookie looks like, you're gonna let Derek do it. Here you go, monkey arms. I wanna keep eating the cookie. The pictures are really cool. Like those, um, what are those chocolate coated, well, chocolate the European cookies. cookies. Yeah, they're just that called European get. cookies, but they don't. I don't remember what they're actually called. It's like a slab of chocolate over top of, um. It's just like a normal biscuit cookie. Yeah, it's just like a plain biscuit, tea biscuit cookie. What are they called? The, with the, the dark chocolate European on the cookies bottom. that we would get. It has the, the little guy standing in the dark chocolate with the biscuit underneath it. What are those called? Wow, you're Italian and you don't know that? I eat them, I don't know. Ah, <laughs> oh, each picture is different. <laughs> well, that one's cool. That one's kind of like stamps. Yeah. Oh, d you're not allowed to eat that one, Dad. Because that one's the top one. Oh! You broke it. I'll take that one. I don't care. I don't mind. Is that a fish? What? If it's a fish, it's mine. It's a fish. It's mine. Yeah, cute. Because I'm a fish. <laughs> oh, and this one's a bird. It, the head got chopped off. <gasps> it's a butterfly. Are These are really cool. It's a butterfly. <laughs> <laughs> and these are probably the ones that are kind of um, like the wafers that are honey then.
trying to think. These kind of taste like those biscuits that are underneath the chocolate. Yeah, I don't know. It tastes like something my Nana Nana had in the cupboard. Like, it really tastes the honey. Mm -hmm. These it's are really good. It's very flowery honey flavor. Yeah. It's good though. These are really good. I don't know what we have here that would mm. compare. Do you know um, your uncle's honey? Mm -hmm. that he, that's what it tastes like. It does pollen. Like, like the pollen honey. Mm -hmm. That's what it tastes like. It tastes like you took a spoon of it. It's really good though. <laughs> These are what you drink with, eat, drink, eat with, with tea. tea. Yeah, yeah totally. <clears throat> I hated this. Those are really good, though. I hated these when I was little because my Nana Nana has stuff like this. Well, she's Russian. She does a lot of those things. So. Oh, she did. Yeah. yeah, did. They were just plain, like, they kind of looked like saltines, but they weren't saltines, which are just holy crackles. <laughs> holy crackles. <laughs> <laughs> well, no, we're towards that. <laughs> okay. Mm. And these ones are from Zurich. And they're, um, the Gottlerbeer, or Libier. It's a praline. I'm not sure if you can even see the box. These are really cool. And if these are anything like our pralines that we have, they're going to be really, really good. And they're individually wrapped, which is really cool. Do you want to show the box? And the cookies? Ours come in a, a tin, but they're not individually we wrapped. We have a load bowl from Switzerland filled with plain and cream. The ones we usually get are either dark chocolate, cappuccino, or hazelnut are the ones that we get here. And besides the regular praline. Mm -hmm. Yeah, these ones look look about the same. Like a rolled cigar. They're, yeah, they're bigger than also. Yeah, they are. They're fatter than ours. And they smell really good. Mm. <laughs> Peanut a can. A really flaky and the praline is really creamy. It tastes like the inside of a rocher. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it does. All you need is to cover it in chocolate, and you'd have mm -hmm. your rocher. Mm -hmm. yeah. Throw a little bit of hazelnut in there. <laughs> Did you wear it? Nope. <laughs> <laughs> These are really good. I don't know, it's a toss up. I really like them all. Mm -hmm. I guess it would kind of depend. Different levels of flavors that are each on their own. Really good. I don't know, I think I'd have to stock all three of them in the house. And the, um, the Terrigil ones, these ones, the Honey Wafer ones, I think would have to be breakfast with tea. Mm -hmm. The lemon would be lunch, with either tea or milk, I would think would be a better one. Well, silk. And then these would have to be the after dinner, mm -hmm. either by itself or just with coffee. Or a dessert tea even, it'd be really good with like a vanilla caramel dessert tea. We should go visit and eat all the food. <laughs> <laughs> like to go visit, definitely. I don't know about eating all the food. Most of the food. We'll come back ten times wider. <laughs> oh gosh. Okay, well, thank you for watching. Daniela, thank you for sending me. Yes, thank you. Yes, thank you. Awesome. <clears throat> and, yeah. They were really good. And I guess we'll see you all in the next one. Hi, thank you again. Very much appreciated.